Now, if you're selling physical products online, then one of the big challenges is to put those physical products into brilliant surroundings so that it helps to sell the product and the product looks amazing. Now, that costs a lot of money too because you've also got to hire a studio, photographers, and it's a, it's a tricky job doing professional photography of products. Well, now you can use AI to transform your pictures of your products from a simple picture like this to a beautiful picture like this on a kitchen counter surrounded by carrots with this carrot juice in this example. So I'm gonna show you exactly how you can do that with any of your products without any of those stresses or concerns of studios and photographers. So here we are in the back end of this software and it's called Photio and there's a link underneath this video. If you wanna go and try it out for free, you can create as many images as you want for free to try it out. And then if you wanna use them commercially, there's different pricing plans and we'll go over those at the end of the video. But let's take a look at what you can do with this because we can literally use AI to create the perfect background for our images. And we've got lots of other useful features too, like actually being able to erase things from an image upload our own background images if we've already got a area that we'd like to see our product appear in. And then they've also got some samples down the bottom here of like really good lifestyle photo shots that you can just, instead of, for example, this cake here, uh, you can just put your product there instead. So, and this shampoo right there, instead of that there, you can have your product there instead. So we've got like this basis here of um, really good background photos that you can use. But I'm gonna create a brand new project right now, and I'm gonna go ahead and upload my product or, or use one of the ones that I've already got, and we'll use this carrot juice right here. There you go. So I've selected that. It's a nice clear image with, with nothing in the background. So if you don't have an image of your product with uh, background free, then you can always upload it into here anyway and remove the background. So it has that ability to do that for you. Now, while we've uploaded it, AI is very busy going, right, okay, what is this product? And um, what would be a really good background and a situation for it to be sat in? Now, because it uh, evidently looks like orange juice, the, the AI has determined that it's a bottle of orange juice, but that is no problem at all because all I need to do is just say, actually, it is carrot juice. And now it will go, okay, let's have a little think about that. In that case, it'd be much more suitable if I were to surround that product, perhaps on a kitchen side with some carrots. So it'll just have a little think. There you go. I've updated the product category to a bottle of juice. Would you like me to create new concept images? And we'll just put yes, there we are. And um, it's got a whole load of other great features that I'm gonna go through and you can really get that image to be just right to sell your product. Because as I say, a really great image of your product is, is what, you know, it's all that anybody has to go on when they're shopping online is the picture. And if they can kind of see it being used, see it in their home, imagine it in their home with your pictures, that really, really helps. So there's our pictures just there. And in fact, I'll just zoom in a little. These are like the concept pictures. And I really like, I think, maybe this one here, because we've got like a bit of a sack there. We've got some carrots laying on the side, the bottle nice and prominent in the middle. So all I need to do is just click that, which lets the AI know that that's the kind of background that I like. And now it will get to work on putting this product right in there. So you can see how unbelievably quick and easy it is to be able to do this stuff. There it is. And it's done it already. And uh, all I need to do now is just click on it like this. Boom. And there you go. Look at that. It's even got the shadow there coming off the bottle and it looks absolutely perfect right there and then. However, we can change it around a little bit uh, if we want to. So for example, I can click on the actual bottle. I can increase or decrease the size. I can twist it around a little bit. I can retouch it if I want to, if there's anything in the way of uh, like background uh, mess or anything like that. If there's just a few bits around it. We can add filters to the whole image. And they've got some sort of pre-done ones there as well. So if you look at the image now, you can see you've got this one, which is called Delicious. Good for sort of food things. This one for Luxurious. And then this one here is like a bright look and so on. So you can play about with these. And then we've got this Blend Naturally feature there, which just helps it to integrate nicely with the background of the image to really make it look like it is sat on that counter. We can adjust how much we do that. There you go. 
so we can just slide this along until we're happy with the look of it i think that one actually looks really good there like that and and there we are it looks fantastic now other things that we can do we can also if we just uh, uh go over to here we can adjust the all the brightness settings the contrast everything of the whole image you know as a whole there you go you can see if i'm not happy with the image color i can adjust that uh, temperature exposure like all of this sort of stuff you've got the full flexibility to change and if you if you want the image as a different size obviously we've got in this uh, square format right here but we can change it to 16 by 9 sort of widescreen format or we can go like, like down the social media route for mobile so you can really create the perfect picture you know for your product and then over on the left hand side there's some more different things now you've got a range of props here as well so I can choose any of these different things here and we can search through the props to add certain elements to the picture so if I wanted to, I could just grab this uh, pepper here like that. And then bang, we've got a pepper on the screen and I can adjust it and decide where I'd like it. I could just put it there like that. You know, anything that you want to kind of just make that picture look exactly the way that you want it. You can go ahead and add in these other elements. And if I likewise, if I didn't want something there, then we can use this erase and replace so if i just didn't want that down the bottom there you can see that there's a little bit of a carrot top plant there i can just go over it like this and there we go and then just put erase marked areas or if i wanted to i could click replace and then have ai put something else in the image like another carrot if i wanted to but for the purpose of this video i'm just going to click erase marked video and then we can really kind of get that picture you know exactly the way that we want but without having to learn how to use photoshop or something you know really complex it's anybody can do this you don't need any experience to be able to do this and there we are if i just click on it look at that look how perfectly it's blended in now that that uh, that tabletop there you would not know that that was how it was so really really high quality so i'm just going to uh, come out of erase and replace then we have some advanced lighting features as well okay so here we are so now we can go ahead and add like a light point if we want to and then we can choose where that light point is using this little circle so if i want to i can just get hold of it by clicking on it and now i can just literally just move it around look at that you can see the glow there coming off so if you want to add like a little glow maybe there's a window up there and i wanted to kind of have this nice light effect coming in to my product i can do that i can adjust the uh, distance of the light like this and then the intensity the radius basically everything that i need so i can have it probably just hitting the product like that really really cool effects and then the plus symbol there you can also have these effects here like sharpen the image expand the image and also add blur as well but i'm really happy with that the only thing i'll do is i'll i'll, um, I'll apply the light effect just there it just takes a couple of seconds to add that into the image and there we go we've got a fantastic looking image right there and we can download it in all of these different formats like jpeg png web uh, webp which is very very small file size and we if depending on which plan you're on you can also adjust whether it has a watermark on or not and then that's it download it and we'll just open up our image here we go and get it into focus and look at that it's huge i think it's about 2.2 megabytes so a real high quality image that you can really use to help sell your product so now let's try a different one here i'm going to start a new project so you go up to the top left and i'm going to choose this time a bike so an altogether different thing there you go look at that a really nice gravel bike like that and now what i'd want to do is i want to create a background so let's just say a background of woods on a sunny day and now the ai will get to work take a look go right okay let's find ourselves a really nice background to go with your product bang and there you go look at this let's just click on that that sells it a little better doesn't it look at that that's amazing kind of woodland path there and you've got your bike right there like that beautiful so you know that looks so much more of a striking photo 
than just a boring white background. You know, now I'm looking at the bike and I'm seeing myself there and thinking about me riding through the woods. It does so much more for you. So a really impressive software. I'm going to just adjust this just now to now we've got it as a 16 by 9. And then obviously I can adjust the, the bike and its positioning and everything in there. And then just go ahead and click download and off we go again. So really great software. Now, um, pricing wise and everything, it's very, very reasonable. So first of all, they do have a free plan, but you can't use it for commercial use. That has to be uh, on a paid plan. But let's take this pro plan here. That gets you um, the watermark of all your images, 2K resolution, the PNG and the WebP download and real high quality images. So $10.50. Can you imagine the saving compared to hiring a studio and a photographer to create your high quality product images? Well, you know, definitely this is gonna save you a fortune. And as I say, there is a link underneath this video if you wanna go and try it out. And then there's FAQs here about what's included with every plan if you wanna find out more. But overall, I think this is the future. I really can see that more companies are going to be using software like Photio here to create those high quality product pictures that actually helps sell the products. That's it for this video. I really hope you liked this. And if you did, then please tell YouTube. And there's another AI related video coming in just a second.